don't even like to do crowd work with someone who says they're an actor. I normally go like, oh, what restaurant have I seen you in? <laughs> but on this occasion, this actor had been in one of the biggest movie franchises in history. That's to come, but first I emptied a gig in front of, well, barely anyone. Anyone watch the uh, Oscars? No? <laughs> no? You're all BAFTA people. <laughs> you're like, I didn't watch that American scum. It's all about the British awards for me. Well, I don't know if, if you may have noticed, even if you did watch the whole ceremony, that they actually, in the in memoriam section, paid tribute to the late Matthew Perry. Did anyone see this? <coughs> no? Well, this is all news for you, isn't it? You get your news here from me today. <laughs> well, the thing which I don't understand is that I reckon that the creators of Friends didn't realise quite how long-lasting the show would be, that it's still popular two decades later. Because otherwise, they'd have called him Chandler Google, right? Instead of Chandler Bing? <laughs> it's so silly, isn't it? New act, new material night. There we go. <sighs> I was still embarrassed from last week, where I put a box on my head. So for the night's second show, I tried some new gags. I'm from Brighton. Well, Hove, actually. Which has nothing to do with the movie Love, actually. Sorry to disappoint all the 30-year-old women in the audience. Actually, that should be the name of my autobiography. <laughs> Sorry to disappoint all the 30-year-old women. So I went to West Hove School, and age five, every day, we'd have to copy down our names from a nameplate, and then we'd have to do it again, not looking at it. And it was months until the teacher went, Richard, why have you got your eyes closed? <laughs> I've tried versions of that last one before. It's a true story, but it just doesn't seem to get a big laugh. Since moving to North London, I don't do many gigs south of the river, but I had a spot at the Horse and Groom in Wimbledon. Keep it going. <laughs> Richard Power, keep it going. Keep it going. Richard Power, keep it going. It's funny you guys mention about uh, st uh, stunt, uh, what do you call them, stunt? Stunt men, yeah. Do we not call them stunt women or stunt people or anyway? I I once met Jason Statham's stunt double. Yeah, uh, genuinely, he had a his arm in a plaster cast. So I don't actually know. Does that make him a good stunt double or a bad stunt double? I, I can't work that out. Sticking with the movies theme, I tried a new tag for my Matrix joke. Being told I look like Keanu Reeves is actually quite insulting. Do I really look Canadian? <laughs> a. Uh, so so, but this got a decent laugh. I speak English and thanks to my Polish side, better English than most. <laughs> I'll leave you that. Hand back to John. Thank you. Look, I love sharing with you all the different comedy nights London and the UK has to offer. To keep doing this, I need your support. It's super easy and free. Please just click that subscribe button. Thank you. To kick off my night, Too Far Comedy, we had someone arrive late, sit at the front, and then eat a plate of salad. Just as you're about to tuck into your meal, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Because I don't want you to talk when you've got food in your mouth. Mm -hmm. Nice to meet you. Thank you for coming. <laughs> What's your name? Tim. Let's all say hello to Tim. Hi, hello, Tim. Tim. Uh, nice to see you, Tim. Uh, why were you late, Tim? <laughs> I was getting food. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, look, great to have you here. Where, where, have you, where have you got your food from? Oh, the, I don't know. They've got some kind of arrangement where there's a restaurant that's not part of the bar, but also... Uh, Kennedy's Fish and Chips. <laughs> uh, I'm not sponsored, <laughs> don't worry. Uh, is it good? Yeah, it's not bad. I've, I've only had a whole bunch of chips and then I'm having salad, so it's kind of cancelling it. No, but I like that. You're like, I'm not going to stink the room out with chips. I'm just going to come up with my salads. I like it, Tim. I like it. Uh, no, no fish, though? Uh, I'll have some chicken. 
Chicken, chicken and chips. All right, nice, nice. Uh, Tim, what would you do for fun when you're not eating your salads? Oh, that's, that's all the fun I have. <laughs> <laughs> That's really, that's really sad, Tim. <laughs> uh, so, like, how bad is your life then? <laughs> pretty awful. <laughs> pretty awful. Have you been to see much live comedy before? Yeah, look, I'm actually a comedian. So <laughs> me and another act have something arranged where I'll, I'll be his bringer tonight. <laughs> <laughs> So like most of the audience. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fantastic. Well done. I think mean, it's named Dan from this. I haven't met him, but just like so you don't cross him off the list. Did oh, you I actually bring someone. No, I told him. Ben to go hours ago. <laughs> oh, look, they're too. Oh, Tim, Ben, Ben, Big Tim. Love it. Lovely stuff. Fantastic. Well done. <laughs> Right, you can catch up later. It's all right. You can talk comedy. You can talk jokes. Uh, well, look, thank you for coming to support Ben and all the comedians. Hope to see you here one day, Tim. Would love to get that. Unless this is you're like, well, normally I sell out the Apollo. Never be seen before here, dead Richard. <laughs> <laughs> He's not responding to that. <laughs> uh, well, I actually uh, once went on a date with a girl. And I asked her what her favourite food was, and she went, chips. I love chips. I love all types of chips. I love crinkle cut chips. I love curly fries. I love french fries. Try to be funny here, right? Even micro chips. <laughs> it didn't compute. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I should have realised she loved chips when she walked in. Because she was wearing wedges. <laughs> so we now know the standard can't be any lower than that. <laughs> We've hit the bottom, so the only way is up, baby. Uh, the Yaz reference there. Very uh, niche. <laughs> I already mentioned it. If you find anything funny, please laugh. Uh, what we also like to do is. <laughs> Uh, as I go to introduce each act, please wait for me to say their name and then just go absolutely batshit crazy. Can we all do that? Yeah! yeah. yeah. Alright, let's do a little rehearsal. Let's pretend Tim is about to come and do his hilarious five minutes and I'll introduce him. Tim, don't get up. I know you're used to it. You've got a salad to eat. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, we'll see what level we're at today. Alright. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage, it's Tim! Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't normally get that applause. <laughs> I enjoyed talking to Tim, but after the interval, I wasn't expecting to speak to an actor from a famous movie. Azim, what happened to you, mate? He was tired. <laughs> <laughs> Boo! Uh, Boo! Uh, I, I did notice that he was he was wearing a vest. Um, was he off to do some beach volleyball? <laughs> Is that where he was going? No. Uh, just just a little bit tired. We're not tired here though, are we? No. <laughs> Really turning this into a panto. Like <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> you can see me as Dick Whittington this November. Uh, uh, I'm going to get to know uh, a few other people. We, we've already known Tim. Uh, we know all about his salad. He's got a nice OJ here. Uh, I was going to speak to your friend here. So I'm going to say hello to you. What's your name? So say hello to Maya! Hi, Maya! <laughs> that was really panto from the back. I loved it. Uh, Maya, how's your day been going? Okay. Oh. <laughs> Are you tired too? I went to Victoria. Oh. oh. What do you do, Maya? I'm an actor. Oh. Mm. So, uh, like, have you been anything we might have seen? Woo! Harry Potter! Harry Potter. Oh. What were you in Harry Potter? I, I'm in Pigworth, Fantastic Beasts. 
Wow. Jeez. <laughs> no, normally when I do crowd work with someone who says they're an actor, I normally go like, oh, what restaurant have I seen you in? <laughs> <laughs> and instead so it's like, yeah, so I've actually been in a Fantastic Beast. <laughs> Johnny Depp, what's he like? <laughs> He's your boss. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Wow. Was he, was he nice to work with? <laughs> Hold on, where can we bring your see these interviews, Maya? <laughs> this, is, this is really interesting. Oh, yeah. uh, well, online, I guess, yes. <laughs> Better plug in my wireless. Get the dial up going. <laughs> Okay. With a lot of, lot of money. <laughs> very, very normal guy. 